I need this next episode already, though. <laughs> we gotta <gasps> wait two weeks this time. Gosh, no! <laughs> no! Oh, I hadn't thought of that. Dang. Okay. Hey, guys. I'm Kat. And I'm Sunny. And this is our... Two cents. Here's some more highlights for Attack on Titan, the final season. As always, if you guys want to be in high quality, or if you want to check out our extended episode reactions the week the show airs, head on over to our Patreon in the i or the link in the description. Last time we got a look into Reiner's past and we got to know why he's done everything he's done up until this point. And just when he was about to end it all, Falco unknowingly but luckily reminded him of what he has to live for. But now it seems like Falco's questioning what he's doing and where he needs to go from here. And then he just so happened to meet a rather familiar face for all of us. And now I don't know what's gonna go from there. Yeah, I don't know where this can go either because we're finally getting into episodes of the manga or from the manga that I haven't read. Yay! Hmm. It's all blind from here on out. I'm hoping we see parody people soon, but if not, that's okay too. Like, I kind of like that we're getting a really good, like, look at the Marlins and the Eldian just to get to see, like, the other side that hasn't been explored as much. I hope they get to flesh this out pretty well. And then the whole conflict actually gets built up well. Especially since they are seeming to be creating, like, parallels between Reiner and Eren. I want these parallels to be, like, really fleshed out so that we really get, like, that contrast between them once they face off. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to face off at some point. I'm excited for it, but I'm also patient. Hmm. For now. Now that we've gotten past the parts that I know. Like, oh, okay. I can wait. I can simmer a little bit. I do wonder if we're going to see the Tiber family soon and meet the Warhammer Titan before we get into the Parody Island people. Get like all the drama with that backstory and like this conflict with them and the other Titans. Probably. Because they haven't, like they introduced these new group of people and they haven't talked about them at all. Mm -hmm. So they gotta, they gotta develop them. Like the whole talk they had about this uh, event gonna happen in Liberio where they wanted the Tiber family to like speak out. Mm -hmm. I think maybe we're gonna get that soon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. See how like Zeke's plan is developing, whatever that is. Let's just get on into this episode and see how the plot develops. Let's go. He looks pretty motivated though. <gasps> uh oh. Yeah, some Kruger. <laughs> Is this like orders or something? Mm, is it to the rest of them? That's what I'm thinking. Mm. He's like thinks he's helping someone and he's gonna be the doom of all of them. Yeah. I wonder who's gonna receive that letter. Right. Is it gonna be Casa? Levi? Armin? Armin? Oh. oh! The whole family? Just out of nowhere? Oh, well, they got their own private military. Damn, they're like... Super above everybody else in that footage. <laughs> Is he the type? Oh, one oh. oh. I can't even they, tell. I don't know. I don't know. I like him. He's charismatic. I probably should not like him. Mm, so he's not okay with this constant war all over the place. Oh. <laughs> it's already too late. Kitaru I think they're planning to like topple the whole system, it seems like. It's like they gave the Marlins their freedom and then now they're <laughs> She's so cute though. <laughs> like, oh hi, good morning. <laughs> She's <laughs> just crawling around. <laughs> He emotes the most with her. He's, yeah. <laughs> Just the north or the south? Which way? Oh, but. Yeah. Okay, the west. Oh, that's true. <laughs> There's no way to go. Oh, they're oh! close. Oh, they're all interested. What he want? Yeah. Oh, I thought they were going to keep going, but wow. It's for you. Oh, oh, oh what? Whoa! <laughs> These guys oh, said it. they probably knew. Yeah, they could probably tell right away. I mean, Aaron guessed right away. Oh, of course. Of course. This little music all chipper. Is that Gabby? Isn't it Falco? <laughs> yeah, right. Or oh, okay, oh, Sophia. Yeah. Where is this cat going? This Bad luck, and a cat, a black cat, passes her. 
けのわからない自己演出をやめろ。いや、私は。ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、He moved. That's what I told him.、Mm -hmm. so、that's what Reiner told Aaron. That's what Aaron told Paco.、Uh. Oh. All of my letters. I've been doing. Yeah. How many has it been? This、uh, baseball、yeah. bit? <gasps> oh, is this the grandpa? Is this his grandpa? His、oh. uncle. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's no, we're not ready yet. <laughs> oh. oh. A lot of people are suspecting. Yeah,、him. they're pointing him out. Uh oh. He's been here too long. <gasps>、mm. oh. That struck a bell with him. Does Aaron know? He、oh. Does he know who he is? Yeah. Maybe. Because he saw him in the flashbacks. He saw his, his memories, right? Oh, is he a patient? Maybe.、Wow. So he's not a doctor. Or maybe he is a, a doctor.、Uh, but he's also a patient here.、Too. Maybe. They can keep an eye on him、yeah. while he's working. Yeah, so they were looking for. Good. Dr. Yeager, not Aaron. Oh, yeah, they're pointing. They're like, oh, he's over there. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah.、Mm, interesting. Are they. Are they waiters? It looks like it.、Yeah. Look like we change. <laughs> go get him! Go get oh my god! <laughs> Is it、oh, a race? I'm so scared. Are they gonna break something? I'm scared they're gonna bump into someone. Oh, nice. Oh, oh good job. Ready. It's like war for them. Yeah, these drums, these battle drums. No! Oh, oh no! <gasps> She's covering. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. She... Is it just because she's kind? Maybe. Is she gonna come back later? Or, yeah, or、something? is she like a spy? And a symbol. Maybe we'll see them later. They'll join them or something. He's u i t d Okay. Yesterday's enemy is. It was、oh. a slip of the tongue, but now they're all on edge. Yeah. Wow. Dude, no!、Mm. Oh, oh he's gonna. Like, ah, it's a joke. <laughs> so, get, get off, off the stage. Yeah. <laughs> wow, he just needs to step up there.、Mm -hmm. This is the influence that he has. Oh. Mm. Oh, it, is oh, it, it kind of looks like. What are those things called? Gallows? Oh. <laughs> like an execution. Yeah, that's what. A theater production or something. He's gonna recreate this, reenact this. Right? Make, probably turn somebody. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, oh my, oh my god. god! This has never happened to them before. Yeah, so many like, outsiders in there. No wonder. Oh my god. Ice She loves it. She's never had ice cream.、Oh. They ran out of money. Oh, he's gonna take care of them. Oh, oh god, gosh, oh, he's just paying. Oh my gosh, pizza! Oh, look at him, he just goes <laughs> lower! His hair、oh, is getting all disheveled! But they're happy! But he's happy too! No! Oh god,、oh, this is their last moment of happiness! Yeah, I bet! Mm, not in a good way though! Oh. Is it gonna. Uh, it it does. does? Oh, okay. <gasps> I was waiting for like an explosion too, or something. Me too, or the, some wall, some building、yeah. to come crashing down. Oh, Falco, Gabby, and Rainy? Oh, I saw Aaron. Oh, maybe. Looks like he's back. Who is he being? Oh, oh, oh they're there. <laughs> are they gonna meet? Oh, goodness. Oh, crap. Are they gonna meet? <sighs> he's so excited, though. I know. It's not gonna be good. <gasps> like with Annie? To trap the Titan? Can't. Oh, no. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. It's been four years. Oh, shoot! He's not even. He doesn't even wait for him to walk in through the door. Hidden. Hidden. Ah! <laughs> Darn it!、Uh, oh my gosh. 
But so neither of them can transform right now because they're in a cellar. Like they'd be trapped, basically. Mm -hmm. So they have to talk it out as humans. They can't fight. They can brawl it out as humans. Oh yeah, I guess they can brawl it out, yeah. But they can't change into their titan form. Right. Oh my god, can you imagine them changing during this festival? Maybe this is the spectacle. You Like the Tibble, Tipper family is like in on it too? I don't know if they're like a part of the plan or if they just know about it or something. I don't know. Just Maybe. know something's gonna happen. Maybe it could. I don't know. I don't know. It's possible. With the way they were like being all vague about it, like it's just some production, mm -hmm. and I have a solution. So You'll like, find out. Yeah. And it's kind of maybe kind of similar to what the parody people want. Mm -hmm. like they just want the Eldians to be free, to not be used as weapons of war. Dang, this episode was good. Dude! Dude! The whole time Falco's so excited. He has no idea what he's Falco's doing. Falco's so innocent. Yeah. Falco's like, just see the best in everybody type of personality. Like, he's like, I made a new friend. He's mm -hmm. asking for you. Come and meet him. Yeah. Like, what reason could he have to bring Reiner down to meet some stranger he met? It's not like they talked about Aaron. They're like, oh, this is, I want you to meet the guy I've been telling you about or stuff. It's not that they showed. Unless I was thinking the other way if he told Aaron about Reiner. Oh. And he's like, let me meet him or something. Oh, that's true. It could be like that, yeah. I didn't think they would actually meet face to face this episode. Yeah, I thought oh it'd be way gosh. later. Yeah. But I mean, I guess as soon as they said, like, as soon as Aaron said about, like, the festival being important, basically, to so mm -hmm. whatever he's planning, it's like, right. oh, okay. That's where it's probably, this is, the, the festival is the catalyst for everything, probably. Mm -hmm. I guess I thought they'd meet when everything was going down, not, like, right before. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is the start of it. I guess I pictured in my head they would see each other in their Titan forms first. Right. Like, or like about to transform or something. Maybe, yeah, like across like in battle. Rooftops or something, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But not not just like, hey, casually strolling down to in a cellar and then I see my arch nemesis. <laughs> right. Basically. I wonder if the other parody people are there too. They're probably around the like, festival. No, but I mean like oh, in, in the, the cellar. cellar. Like if they're they're gonna like enclose Reiner in the cellar. <sighs> Like somehow Mikasa and Armin are, are like on the other side, outside mm -hmm. of the cellar, and they close the door and they trap them in there or something mm -hmm. with Falco. Because at this point, now that Reiner knows that Aaron's there, they can't let him go back outside. Right. So I'm guessing this is where your captured scenario is going to happen. <laughs> like they're going to capture him and he's going to be like, maybe willingly telling them stuff. Or they're, they're going to be getting, like, information from him and stuff. Maybe. Especially since they have Falco there, too. He's like, he, they could torture Falco. Use him as, like, a bargaining chip mm -hmm. to get information from Reiner. Hmm. If they are all there. Uh -huh. If this is all part of everyone's plan, not just, like, Aaron going off on his own. I'm kind of expecting Reiner to get out of there and kind oh. of tell them. And I'm kind of thinking maybe the other Parody Island people are outside in the festival and that the other Titans might transform and basically they'll end up showing all these outsiders how dangerous they are. Ah, oh, so you think, you're thinking that's, that's like, show that's, or whatever. oh, okay, so you're thinking that demonstration, like showing off the Titans is the Tibber family's plan? Or do you think it's, are you thinking it's like the Parody Island plan? Not both. Both? <laughs> Like, I don't think that's what Parody Island wants, but maybe Tibber will know that. Mm. Tiber? Whatever. I forget, yeah, I yeah. don't know. Um. Like, maybe they are trying to keep it on the down low and, like, start with Reiner, but then things aren't gonna go well, and then there's just gonna be chaos. Maybe. I guess, yeah, because it is looking like the... Willy, his plan, his agenda is kind of aligning with what the Parody people want. Which is a freedom. Like, I feel like, in a sense, it will align with it, but then they also have their own things that they want. Mm. Hmm. So basically, it's gonna be like a enemy of my enemy is my friend type of situation. Kind of like how that one politician was saying, like, today's this enemy. Oh, yesterday's yes. enemies are today's enemies. Or like, whatever. yeah, like, they're all still enemies. Mm. 
of course, it could go any way. It could just yeah. be completely different. Yeah, I mean, yeah, at this, it's just a turning point at this point mm-hmm. in the story. Something's going to change, like how Gabby said. Mm-hmm. But I don't think it's going to be the change she's wanting. No. And it's probably not going to go along with any set plan that, people, right. that the different groups have. I don't know what they're going to talk about. What are you doing here? What, why are you alive? <laughs> I guess what what Aaron wants to say to Reiner. Is it going to be like, prepare for battle? Or like, we're coming to get you? Or like, hey, here's a deal? Or I'm going to kill you. Carry on. No, I don't know. Carry on? <laughs> Just let you know. <laughs> Will there be some coded message? I don't know. Or like, maybe not coded, but like double meaning kind of thing. Maybe. I feel like they're gonna fight a little bit and then eventually they're gonna come to like some potential understanding. Even if that understanding is just like, we gotta kill, we, we gotta fight. Mm. Cause there's bad blood between us. So I was just, meh. There's no other, cho- you have no other choice. Yeah, cause like the whole situation we talked about before where like he is helping them even if he's like a prisoner or something, a uh, Reiner to the Parody Island mm-hmm. people. I feel like it's too early for that. Like I do feel like they need to fight it out first. Like fight on their respective sides. There has to be some reason why they decided to have the festival inside of Eldian territory, like within the walls. Like normally they wouldn't allow anybody else except for Eldians to go into there because it's like run down it's like it's it has like a stigma with it but they are like open it up to all these foreign people Mm -hmm. and they're like putting on a show for them Mm -hmm. but within a rundown area are they setting it up for something so yeah like I don't know if they're bringing them there to see something or to become the victims yeah <laughs> and then just like okay all your leaders are gone i'm your leader now cat 2021 <laughs> this is potentially turning out to be bigger than before like because it could be that the the tibber family's goal is to just conquer everything because mm-hmm. they were saying that like um how the marlians are like warmongering right now mm-hmm. That they're trying to bring a stop to that, and the way to bring a stop to that is either to stop fighting or to control all of the world. We are all one nation <laughs> under me. Yeah, it could be that too. I did like this scene we got of Aaron talking to his grandfather. That was <laughs> that was kind of brutal. Yeah, seeing how far his grandfather has deteriorated after what he's experienced. Because, like, when he greeted Zeke when they got back, I thought he was pretty normal. But it looks like everything that's happened has taken a toll on him. Like, I wonder when Aaron knew it was his grandfather. Like, it was it when he said his name, when he approached him, when he started talking about, like, his son and daughter. You think he knows? I think he does. Oh. Because, like, he saw him in his father's memories. Oh, that's right, that's right. Yeah, he did. But, like, of course, he's aged. He looks a little different. So I just wonder when he knows it. When he realized. I mean, they didn't show like a moment of like recognition with Aaron, right? Right. Like they didn't have like a his eyes widening or anything. So that's why I kind of think he knew from the start. Like, mm-hmm. oh, here he is. I'm curious what he thought in that moment, but we might not get that. He just, he was kind. Maybe he was just like numb to it. Didn't think much of it. Maybe, yeah. It's just like a like like a stranger that you know is part of your family, but you've never talked to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So the festival is underway and Reiner and Aaron have finally met. We just gotta see what happens with this confrontation in the next episode. None of this would be possible without all of your support and we just want to give a special thanks to Brandon Scott, Dark Demon 913, Luis A. Sandoval, Chris Poveroni, Phoenix Yang, Jai Go, Takeshi, Jacob, Conroy, Kokos, Jim Fungbrandt, Nato, Deon, Brian and Mika and Joku, Anna Chelli, Mike Edwards, DJ Cunning, Kazu, and Jaeger. It's thanks to the support of all these wonderful people and all of our patrons on our Patreon that we can keep making videos like this one. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys. These are awesome. If you like what you're seeing, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see more, you can check out our past videos. Don't forget, you can follow us on our socials, linked in the description. Thanks for watching. Please stay safe, everyone. And we hope to see you next time. Bye. Bye.